The following question reads that liquid X and Y are stored in large open tanks. Uh, so the two liquids stored in a tank, liquid X has density 800 kilogram per meter cube and uh, liquid Y has a density of 1200 kilogram per meter cube. So Y has a greater uh, density. And the question is at which pressure are the, uh, at which depths are the pressures equal? So here you can see uh, my two ta tanks, uh, one is Y, the other one is X. Uh, y has greater density, um, X has lesser density. Uh, and what we need to figure out is at what depth uh, would the pressures be equal. Uh, the formula for pressure is rho GH, so it's, uh, it's going to be rho into G into H over here. And the pressure that would be exerted at the bottom over here as well would also be rho uh, into G into h uh, so it's going to depend on density into uh, gravity into height and this over here is the height of the two liquids uh, what we just need to do is uh, uh, we know density so this is uh, 1200 over here uh, into gravity which is uh, 9.81 into height now uh, this h over here would be substituted each time for example uh, y over here in the first one is 20 uh, the same would be done over here as well it's 800 into gravity which is 9.81 into height which uh, we're going to substitute so so let's uh, pick the first values and see if the answer comes out to be the same so let's calculate pressure for the first one h over here is uh, it's going to be taken as uh, 20 and h over here is going to be taken as 8 uh, so if you do this on your calculator and you're going to, uh, you can do the calculation, you, uh, I don't need to do the calculation, you can mentally also work this out. So 12 into 2, that would be something 24 into 9.81, over here it's 8 into 8, that's 32, 8 into 8 is 64 into 9.81. So basically both values are going to come out to be different. So, so the first option, the first option over here, option A is going to be incorrect and I'm going to mark that as incorrect. Let's move to option B now, uh, for option B... Uh, you have a different value of H. So in option B, uh, H is 15. So let's put 15 over there uh, 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 in Y. And uh, you can see that it's 10 in X. So let's put 10 over there. And let's see if uh, we're going to get the same answer. So 15 into um, 1200 and 10 into 800. This uh, would be 8000. And if you multiply 12 and 15, uh, you're not going to get uh, a number that would be around it. So these two values are also not coming out to be exactly the same. So let's uh, cut option B as well. Now move to option C. If you move to option C, uh, X is 15. So H would be over here, that's uh, 15. And over here, uh, uh, the other one in Y, the height is 10. So let's uh, put... 10 over there if I do that uh, I'm going to get the same value because uh, you can do this on your calculator 12 into 10 that's around uh, 12,000 into 9.81 800 into 15 is also 12,000 into 9.81 so both are going to give you the same exact pressure values so you can do the calculation you, you're going to get the same exact answer so so C option C is going to be your correct option for this question